Before beginning with the video, please subscribe my channel and press the bell icon to stay updated of my latest videos. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel Best of PowerPoint and I am back with a very interesting intro logo animation effect in PowerPoint. Let's have a look what we will be creating today. So there are a variety of effects combined together beautifully to create this intro logo an animation effect such as the paint stroke effect and then the color split effect. So let's quickly start with the tutorial and learn how to amaze your audiences with this awesome animation. To begin with, create a new slide and change its background color to black. Insert a text box and enter your desired text. Please note that this animation is to be used for your title headings and while keeping in mind that the heading can be easily split into two different parts. Like in my case, I am using my heading best of powerpoint and I will be splitting up into two parts, best of will be one part and powerpoint will be the second part which I will add on later. I will change the font to the bold font and if you want to know how to install new fonts for powerpoint. I have already made a separate video for this which you can watch from the YouTube show notes below. Increase the font size and also increase the character spacing to about 10 to 12 points. Now open the selection pane from here and I will rename this text box as white best of. Since the font color is white, so yeah, white best off. And now you need to insert the main element of this animation effect, which is the paint stroke image. I will be providing the download link for this image in the description box below. So kindly download the image from there first. Drag the image like this and adjust its size. Now insert a text box and I will insert the second part of my text that is PowerPoint. Change the font and adjust its size. Keep the font color as black. Now select both the image as well as the text and group them together. In the selection pane, rename this group as black stroke since the font color is black. Next. Go to the insert tab and insert a rectangle shape in the slide. Fill the whole slide with the shape and change its color to yellow. Right click and send to back. Duplicate this white best of text. Change its font color to black and overlap the two text boxes completely. Similarly, duplicate the stroke group and change the font color to red. In the selection pane, kindly rename this new group as red stroke since the font color has been changed to red now. And also rename this black text as black best of. For the same reason, the text is of black color. Now while overlapping the stroke groups, select the original black stroke group first. Go to the format tab, hit the align button and then select align center and then align middle. Do the same with the red stroke group. In this way, the two groups will be completely overlapped with each other without much effort. Now in the selection pane, hold the shift key and carefully select the black best off, the yellow rectangle shape and the red stroke group. And then group all these elements together. I will name this new group as BG group. So in total, when broadly classified, I have three main elements in the slide or in my selection pane, which are the BG group, which includes black best of yellow rectangle and the red stroke group. Then I have the black stroke group. And finally, the white best of 
text box and after arranging all the elements in this way it's time to animate them please note that the order of element should be like this only first the pg group then black stroke and then white best of only then our animation will work all right now select the white best of and add fade entrance effect to it open the animations pane and open the effect options of this effect under the timing stamp select start after previous and set the duration time to 1.5 seconds then select black stroke and add wipe entrance effect to it open the effect options and change the direction from bottom to from left under the timing tab select start after previous and again set the duration time to 1.5 seconds and click okay now finally select the pg group click on add animation then more entrance effects and from here choose the split animation effect open the effect options and change the direction from vertical in to vertical out under the timing tab select start after previous and set the duration time to 1.5 seconds and click okay that's it let's see what we have achieved so far perfect so this is how you can amaze your audiences with a simple yet beautiful animation technique so that's it guys i hope that this video was helpful to you please like and share the video and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button thanks for watching and see you in my next video